Hi guys, welcome to the next episode of The Beast on the Road. This time I'm leaving to Serbia, country that is situated in a beautiful area. I spent hours and hours of planning this trip. It's a bunch of friends that we are going together. But honestly, I don't know what's gonna happen. Sometimes even Google Maps was, was useless. Sometimes the Google Maps told me, okay, next 200 kilometers, you will be doing in seven hours. I'm pretty sure it's gonna be crazy. Guys, before we'll start, big thanks to a company called Slingmots. They're partner for this video, they're partner for this trip. And if you'd like to see several upgrades, because there are a shop for aftermarket parts for spiders, rikers, I have several of their updates on my bike on the beast. So if you're interested in, the videos are on the top. Now, enough of this, I will pack my cameras, put some stickers so the Serbs know that I'm coming from beautiful country of Slovakia. I'll say goodbye to Riško and we see each other in Subotica, which is a city where the Serbian journey begins. And if you like what I do, don't forget to subscribe, hit the like button, and remember, always have fun. Finally, the group of old people has arrived as well. So let's our journey begin. Hola. Welcome to Serbia. Subotica is the city where our journey begins. Oh, yesterday it was a little bit too much of uh, rakia, which is basically a destillate or alcohol done by any kind of fruit you can imagine. Generally. Anyway, a uh, little bit about the Serbia in general. A uh, country has a population of uh, 7 million. Most of the people are Orthodox Christians, like 90%, something like that. Capital city is Belgrade. Currency, yeah, we are millionaires <laughs> because they have a currency called uh, uh, Serbian dinner. In respect to their borders, um, they are situated in between uh, Romania, Hungary, Bosnia and Herzegovina, Croatia. Uh, they claim they have borders with Albania, which is kind of true, kind of not, because there is Kosovo in between. Guys, enough of this. Now we are going to Belgrade. First full day in Serbia, I'm trying to walk over the heavy lunch that I have had. Uh, the dish is called Karado Deva Schnitzel. I like the story behind, so I had to try it. Schnitzel is nothing like really super special for me because we have it in our country. But the story in behind is quite nice. Uh, one dude in 1950 something uh, had a visitor from some Soviet country and he wanted to cook some dish that he didn't have enough uh, chicken for it. So uh, he decided that uh, instead of it, uh, he will cook veal, roll it, bread it, fry it, put some cheese inside. And he was rewarded a medal because it was really delicious dish. And the medal of honor is called uh, after a Serbian revolutionary, Karador Deva. Now we will hit finally the mountains, really the part that I'm looking forward to.
this is it from the first part of our Serbian trip. I'm just cutting the next episode. So if the video is ready uh, at the end screen or down in the description, feel free to continue our journey. Yeah, we will be fighting the missing bridge and we are lost in the Serbian woods with a lot of mud. And uh, I can tell you the beast was giving it all. Thank you very much for watching. If you like what I do, hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. Most importantly, remember, always have fun.